Hey there, teachers. How many of you log on to your computer every day, go into Chrome, and pull up all of the tabs that you need for the day? It takes some time. So I'd like to share with you something that I learned a while back and was a game changer for me. And I also would like to just show, for those of you who have heard about the possibility of making folders for your bookmarks, um, I want to show you how I go about doing it. So first thing that's really important, and just taking it slowly because understanding that everyone is at a different level with this, Right now, I am in Google Chrome. It's important that you know that that is the web browser that I am showing here. Um, it, other web browsers do have similar capabilities, but we're focusing with Google Chrome. So right here, this is what we call the bookmark bar. Some of you may not see that. And if you don't see it, go up to the three dots, click on bookmarks, and there's a part that says show. So yours may look like this. So you'd go to bookmarks then go to show bookmarks bar, and then it should pop up there. Your bookmarks are accessible either in the bar or some of you may take the long route and go to bookmarks and then go all the way here to find your bookmark. Well, we're going to save you some time today. So bookmarks are awesome. For those of you who don't know how to bookmark a site, it is very simple. You just go over here and click on the little star to make that star blue, then you can type in the name of your bookmark and you push done. A lot of us just do that and we have a gazillion bookmarks to scroll through. So we're going to organize our bookmarks into folders. So you're going to see that I have my Google Classroom, I have my plan book here, Epic Reading, um, our Skyward Logon system for attendance, and Clever. Those are some websites, some of them, that I use every day. I want to put those into a, book, um, a bookmark folder that just is for my school day. So I'm going to come over to these three dots again, go to bookmarks, and then I'm going to go to bookmark manager. When I go to the three dots in my bookmark manager, I can add a new folder. I'm going to just call mine school day. It added school day over on the left side here. And I'm just going to drag these right into it. These are all of the websites that I have bookmarked that I open every single school day. All right. So now you can see I have school day over here. I'm going to drag this over to the left because I use it most often. All right. And now you'll see that my bookmarks are nice and organized here. We'll get to that in a second. Now, those are things that are already bookmarked, just like I have quizzes, my Go Guardian, and Voki. So, quizzes and um, Voki and Go Guardian, I'm going to find a spot for them as well. Um, and Kahoot. So, I see Kahoot and quizzes, those are kind of, those are more games. So, I'm going to just um, put them as games. And again, You'll come up with the folders that make the most sense for you um, as far as names go. Go Guardian, I'm going to use that as a, I use that every day actually, so I'm putting that in my school day. And then Voki, I'm going to put that under my ELA websites because I use that for my ELA class. So look how nice, neat, and tidy our bookmark bar looks now. That's awesome. So when you come here to, your bookmarks, if you were to just click on it, it opens it. Cool, right? But then let's say I wanted to click my other one. It opens it in the same tab. All right, I get that. But, or I could go here and then click on them. Well, that all seems like way too much work for me. So I'm going to come back and I'm going to click. Now, if you are just regular clicking on your Mac or if you're left clicking using a PC, you're only going to be able to open one of these at a time and you'd have to go to a new tab to open the next one. But let's say I've come in and this is usually, usually the screen that 
appears, all right, I wanna get my school day started, let's go, right? So if you have a PC, you can right click on the folder, or if you're using a Mac, hold on control and click, and you can then click and open all of those tabs at the same time. So now, talk about being ready for your day. When we go through, it is opening, as my internet is working here, all of the tabs, which is pretty awesome. I hope that this saves some time for you. Think about the bookmarks that you have and the best ways that you can organize them into folders, knowing that with a simple right click on the folder, you can open all of those bookmarks that you'd like. An awesome use for this as well, if you are on a Zoom or a Google Meet and you are presenting to your class, um, it absolutely is has been a lifesaver, game changer, time saver um, for me to be able to just open them all and have access to them. You could make folders for particular meets or presentations. This is applicable beyond school as well, so you can use this for, for personal as well. I hope that this is helpful.